Hello there, my name is Lockley and welcome back to the Guild Rock SMP. And today I'm going to give the Prank War a little bit of a break and I'm going to show you something that I've been working on while the Prank War has been going on. So let me go down to the basement of Lock Manor. So I've actually been working on a small project in my basement and I feel like this will revolutionise the server. So if I just head down, you will see that this is a portal that I've made. Now this isn't just a normal nether portal, it, it can act like a normal nether portal, however you can see here it says shopping district, so if it says whatever it, location it says on this sign and if this light is on it will bring me to that location. So if I go through this portal now, like I will show you, it will, it will send me straight to the shopping district, so let me just show that to you there. And just like that, I'm actually in the shopping district. So that brings me straight from Lock Manor to the shopping district. Now, this doesn't work the other way, so I do have to walk all the way back through the Never to Lock Manor. However, it does save me half a trip. Now, one thing that I do want to test is what would happen if, well, if I turn this light off, that will just send me to the Nether because this will not be activated. So this would just act like a normal Nether portal. However, I want to see what happens if I make this sign blank, so I just delete all of that, and then I turn this light on, because apparently it will send me nowhere, but I'm not sure if it will send me to the nether or if it will just send me to a random place, I'm not sure. So I'm actually going to go through this portal and try it. I'm now going to try and go through this portal and see where it takes me. I'm actually really curious, uh, so... Let's see. Um, where am I? Um, oh, oh no. And now for the final part of the video, we're gonna put all our stuff away so that you can get it in the world download. So if you do get the world download, my stuff will be in my storage room in these two chests. So I'll put my inventory in there. And then my ender chest will go in there. And now that we've done all that, all I have to do is sit back and wait for Rocket to tell me that it's time to go. Uh, hopefully we leave before the meteors. But uh, any What was that noise? Um, that didn't sound right, okay. Uh, ah! Oh, my head. Oh, Oh god, my head. Ah, oh, well, who was that? Wait, wait hold on a second. What, why am I underground? Uh, 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 oh. Um. My entire city is, is destroyed. I, I, I don't know how to feel about this. Um, I mean, that meteor... I mean, I knew it was going to destroy the city, but I didn't think I'd still be here. Uh, I'm not going to go too close to that. It's still smoking, but wow. I mean, that has left a pretty big... 
dent on the city. If I'm going to stay here, that's going to take quite a while to fix. Okay, I've decided that I'm not going to stay here. I need, I need to get out of this place. I mean, look at it, the sky's not even blue. Um, hold on a second. I was meant to get on that rocket. Let's see if they left without me. Oh no, it's not looking good. Oh, the rocket's gone. I mean, it's, it's good that they're good and they're safe, but I'm here by myself. I've decided to go over and see what's happening. Like, see if the bridge, the bridge isn't, oh no. Uh, that water doesn't look good either. Why is it green? Um, I think I'm gonna need to go take a closer look at that. Okay, the water appears to be some sort of portal. Um, I'll be honest with you, I don't really want to touch this. Um, I, I don't know if it'll, if it'll kill me or take me somewhere worse than this, I don't know, but I'm going to try and stay as far away as I can from that stuff, because I mean, it seems to have swallowed up part of the bridge, because I don't know where all that debris has gone. And also with this bridge broken and the nether portals not working for some reason, I'm not able to get to spawn or the shopping district, so I'm going to have to find some other way of getting things so that I can survive out here. So at the end of last season, I sold the interiors of these buildings off, apart from this main one, which was me and I decorated, but all my storage is gone. So I'm going to see if anyone has left any things behind that I could possibly use at all just to survive. So, Hawkon's building. There's an ender chest. Oh, that's right. I took all my stuff out of the ender chest at the end of the season. Oh, no. Anyway, um, there's an observer. I can use that. Oh, there's some plants. There doesn't seem to be many of them around anymore, so that's good. And I can't open that top chest. Uh, there's another one here as well. Oh, okay. Gonna take these. Um, if I remember rightly, there's nothing past this point. So, I guess this is all the stuff that I have for now. You know what, I want to see what happens if something does touch this water so I'm gonna I'm gonna throw an item down and just see what happens to it so I'll I'll drop it off this point uh, oh um, it's gone oh I'm so bored uh, oh, oh, is this a fucking quill nice I can write in it um, thanks gods it's either a portal or it just disintegrates things, so I'm just going to stay very far away from that because I don't want to take my chances. After searching the rest of the buildings, all I found was this cool looking scarf. And, I mean, it doesn't smell very nice, and in fact smells really bad, but I'm going to keep it on because it looks cool. Actually, it... <coughs> <coughs> This scarf is making me quite dizzy. <coughs> Welcome to your sacrifice. Uh, who is... D Dickie, is that you? At once, yes, I was Dickie. But now, I am more. Uh um, uh, uh, okay, uh, what, what happened to my scarf? Uh, I, I thought it looked quite cool. I tossed it into the hellfire over there. You won't be needing it much longer anyway. Wait, hold on, you, you say I'm not going to be here much longer? Am I going home? Uh, uh, yes, you are going home. Home to the blood god. Right, I'm putting the book 
for a portal because I want someone to find it and I want someone to see that they should not go to Log Manor and use that portal because it is dangerous and I'm trapped here. And I don't really want to go for any of these portals, so I'm going to sign it and I'm going to throw it into there. Just like that, I, mean, I hope it gets found. You know what? I may as well jump into it. No, 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 please, please do not kill me. Please. Do not consider this a killing. It is a sacrifice. A sacrifice to the nether. Uh... Um... In, sa sacrifice? Yes. A sacrifice to the nether. This nether requires a blood sacrifice. A sacrifice to the blood gods in order to continue to grow. It will overtake this land. Uh, are, you are you sure? You, you know you don't have to do this. You can sacrifice pigs and stuff. Uh, I mean, you, you've, there's, there's goats now. The blood god requires a human sacrifice. Pigs and goats will not do. It is your blood that will fuel this ever-growing nether. Now it is time for you to meet the blood god. <laughs> 